Mayor of Chaos. I'm so glad you decided to stop by. If you're new here, then welcome, and I hope that you stop by again. If you're a regular subscriber, thank you for subscribing. I really appreciated that. So, we are going to go on an adventure at Johnny Appleseed Park. So, let's see what is beyond this bridge right here. This trail leads to. It might not lead to much, but we'll see. Ooh. It's like an enchanted forest. corner from there is where we just came out of and so since it was pretty much a dead end I took you guys out and here's another shot of the water just a nice easy breeze today so let's continue down this path and see what we find to anything. Just a little open grass spot. Great spot for a private little picnic.
tree. All right, now for some adventure again. You see this hill? We need to climb this hill and we will come to a grave site. Are you ready? Okay, let's go. Johnny Appleseed died 1845. So here lies Johnny Appleseed. If you don't know who he is, I don't quite remember either myself, but I do know that he was very famous for planting apple trees all over the place. And he was a really good guy. I haven't read the book in a while. It's actually one of my absolute favorite books, so I'm surprised I can't remember much about it, but, you know, I guess that's how it is. And then there's Sarah. Let's go get a closer look. Sarah, wife of Jeff Porter, or Jay Porter, October, hmm, I think it's, I see 37. I'm not sure the first digits for that. It's really hard to read. Then over here, there's another one. It says, Charles H. died February 24th, 1873, I think. Age. Boy, it's really hard to read, but. Yeah, a lot of these people are from the 1800s. So, it's really interesting. I wonder, there is a sign over there. I bet, it, I bet it gives the history. Let's go check it out. See over there? There's a wooden platform thing. Let's go over there. Let's go. Here we go. And boom. All right, here we go. Johnny Appleseed, 1774 to 1845. Johnny Appleseed, a legendary planter of orchards across Ohio, Indiana, and Illinois. He was a real person named John Chapman. He was a friend to all God's creatures and a missionary for the Swedenborgian religion, a Christian denomination. He was also a smart businessman. Moving ahead of the waves of westward bound settlers, he purchased property, carefully sowed apple seeds, and had seedlings available when settlers arrived. His seedlings were valuable because apples were highly nutritious and orchards were a symbol of permanency. He sold trees for three cents if you can plant them, if you planted them, and 6.53 cents if he planted them for you. Johnny was also very generous, often saying, pay me when you can. So isn't that cool? tour of Johnny Appleseed Park. I really hope you enjoyed yourself and thank you so much for coming along. Please make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can come with me on more adventures and I will see you in my next video.